Hey my ladies and my gents, I'm Stephen Tosher and this lovely lady right here is my mom. Hey mom, how are you feeling today? Lovely. Lovely, eh? Alright, well Mrs. Lovely, we're going to be making some lovely bell peppers that are stuffed uh, vegetarian styles and meat lover styles. So, let's get at it. Okay, here we have one medium bell pepper at around 40 calories. We have two heaping spoons of salsa around 30 calories. We have 35 grams of corn, which is around 30 calories. We have a pinch of garlic powder, put a little bit of black pepper and salt or maybe some spices at your own discretion. So either way, if you're going to go to the vegetarian way or if you're going to go the meat way, you're looking at around 100 calories for the base of both of these recipes, okay? Now, if you want to go the vegetarian way, the lar uh, sorry, the four or five mushrooms here, which is around 100 grams of mushrooms, you're looking at around 15 calories. We have around uh, 10 to 15 grams of carrots, which is around 7 to 10 grams, uh, uh, sorry, 7 to 10 calories. And over here, we have two uh, tablespoons of chopped up green olives, which is around 30 calories. So in total, for the pepper and all the concoction and the spices for the vegetarian side, you're looking at 150 calories. Now if you want to do the meat side of things, we have 85 grams of ground turkey. And that is equivalent to about 17 grams of protein. And this is around 120 calories. And we'll have, uh, be using one teaspoon of oil around 30 calories. And we'll be using 15 grams of shredded cheese. So this right here will be 200 calories, making the entire process for the meat side around 300 calories. Okay, so step one, you want to chop up the peppers and you want to go lengthwise with it because you want to put as much contents in as possible. So I just slowly crack it open and I'm going to get most of the contents out. And then you're just going to chop up any of the other vegetables you may want to add in, including the mushrooms. You want to make them nice and fine. So you'll chop them up even smaller than this into small little cubes. Step three. Okay. Uh, now we... Uh, brought the water to a full boil and then I'll add a little bit of salt, just a little bit of salt, a pinch, pinch of it. And uh, then we're going to add the peppers to cook for, steam it for between three and five minutes. Alright, so now we're going to add the vegetable filling in for our stuffed peppers. So I have my pinch of garlic pepper. I'm just going to put all the bottom here. I'm going to throw in my salsa and the corn. All right. And then I'm going to add in the delicious mushrooms. Now, I'm not going to use all of these. I like to mine on the side. <laughs> and then I'm going to put in my olives. All right. And I'm just going to mix this up. And when the peppers are done, this will be the filling for uh, my vegetarian pepper. As you can see, it's getting nice and solution-y and it's going to all cook together and all the flavor and seasoning is going to come together. And I'm only going to add a little bit of salt, which I um, was able to turn and break earlier. And I'm just going to add a little bit of pepper in here as well, just to give it a little more flavor. And you can make this as spicy as you'd like. Alright, so now that we have the filling for the vegetarian side done, we still have the carrots uh, sitting here waiting for that to sprinkle on top. And we also have the cheese right beside. We're going to now go into the meat side of things. So we have the 85 grams of meat and we're going to put in a teaspoon of extra virgin olive oil just to fry the meat up. And then we're going to mix it all together and stuff these peppers. All right, so you put the oven on to 325 at this point. You want to preheat the oven for five minutes, and then you're going to fill up your peppers. So I've just mixed and matched the peppers here, and I'm just going to fill it in. I'm going to press down on it. Oh, mom's going right in there. 
Uh, she doesn't care. I don't think she has much heat receptors. These are fresh <laughs> out of the oven here. They're a little warm. They're a little warm. Oh, you're good. Eh? You're a trooper. Okay, and so for me, I'm going to be halfway point. I'm going to be taking the carrots, dropping some of the shaved carrots in there. And then once again, I'm going to just start stuffing this thing. And you, that's the beauty of this is you can just, you can completely just um, fill it right to the top. And, uh, you know, everything is just going to be pretty awesome. That's my grandma talking in the background. I guess she doesn't realize we're filming. Sorry about that. Um, all right. So just fill that up there. Mom, you're going to throw some cheese on there. I almost got, and this pretty much fills up the entire... Um, you know, pepper here, and then just throw your carrots on here or your cheese. Okay, you can put in as much as you want, and the beauty is whatever is left over can go directly into your mouth. So it's been cooking for about 15 minutes now at around again 325. I'm going to turn this off here. I'm going to jump in here. The peppers are starting to um, change color a little bit, they're starting to get kind of wrinkly, which is kind of well, what you want. They're, they're heated up now. And I'm just going to dish this into the plate. So, Mom, do you have anything else that you'd like to add uh, to this at all? Do you want to help me there, Mom? Thank you. Oh. Oh, you got to be very careful here. Yeah, this is... It's gotten in there pretty deep. Oh, okay, Mom? Now, let's try it. I want to get Mom's first reaction on here, ever, ever. Oh, it's a little bit hot. Let's try a little bit before the meaty one. I'm going to go for the vegetarian one here. Oh, yeah. Oh, God, it seems to be mm -hmm. this. This salsa brings out a lot of taste here. Mm -hmm. Good. Mm -hmm. I like it? Very good. Very nice. Very tasty. Now, again, the salsa is key because it's like really, really simple for you to get out here. This is. It's absolutely delicious. Packed with vitamins and proteins and... And the beauty behind it is, again, there's beautiful. no carbohydrates. Aside from the carbohydrates that are inside the fruits and vegetables. Healthy carbs. If you have any comments or questions, drop it in the comments section below. If you'd like to check out anything that pertains to the video, you can see that in the description. I just want to say thank you so much for watching. Have yourself a wonderful day, evening. Morning and night. God, God bless. bless. Oh yeah, and if you like what I'm doing, please tweet, tumble, like, share, thumbs up, plus, pin, or do whatever you do, and please, subscribe.